Hey, Pooh Bear, what are you standing in front of? Um, my TV. What's missing here? On, oh, what, what do you think should have been here in this I, house? I think a fireplace would have looked nice right here. You think so? Yeah, I think it would. Hmm. So, move over a second. So you think we should put a fireplace there? Yeah, I think so. You know how expensive that would be? Yeah, about $600. <laughs> For a real one? Yeah. For a real fireplace? Well... For, what? For a real fireplace, it'd take thousands and thousands because uh, where would the chimney go? Yeah, we. You have would have no stairs. Yeah. So, all right. Well, what do you think? We go get one then. Okay. That all right. You ready to go get one? We'll put one right there. Yes. All right. You think I can get you one? I bet you can. All right. So, what do they cost? Around six hundred. Really? Or more. I've seen them like online for like 200 oh that's in babies huh oh yeah so you want a simulated ones. fireplace yes is it gonna look like a real fireplace yes it will all right let's go see what we can get okay let's go all right what what's this shit about i'm excited why because i think it's gonna be really cool when we get it in here okay all right all right pooh bear i'm out for now <laughs> okay shaber i'm out for now <laughs> <laughs> bye bye What are you doing? I am buying a fireplace. No. Yes. Which one? Show me. Uh, we're going to get this one right here. We are. Yes, we are. But it's going to look real pretty in the home. You think so? I know so. You know so. Yes. What's this for? For my Christmas present and my birthday present and anniversary and everything else for the next five years. <laughs> I don't, wouldn't go that far, but, but you just had a birthday. We just had an anniversary and Christmas is coming up. Yeah, so, so we're kind of rolling it all in one. And we're going to fit, fit this big thing in a box on top of... The Buick. Yeah, we're going to see what happens. All right, we got to roll around and go get it, huh? Yes, yes we do. All right. All right. We'll be back with you. All right, Pooh Bear out for now. Okay, so we're starting to put together the fireplace we got. <laughs> What's this the fireplace we got? So, this is the beginning stage of it. We actually got the first piece put together so there we go first piece is on and we got let's see got all that to do I got all this video go I did in the house I was moving a little fast because it's been a while yeah. yeah got all this to do so we'll keep you posted on how we're doing and it all came in what a big it, was it, all came, it came in an eight foot box and guess what we hauled it in the buick we took it all out <laughs> right there in the freaking parking lot well behind and put it all inside the car didn't have to put anything on top what's that big box over there honey that's the fireplace that was makes the fires burn baby yeah <laughs> well, it's technically a light but you can adjust your brightness and it does put out heat. Yeah, so it's a working fireplace. It's electric, but it's, like it's gonna four thousand BTU or something. It'll 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 heat a square uh, four hundred square foot room. So there we go. So we're going to keep uh, putting some of this together, and as we do a little bit more, we'll show you a little bit more. And uh, hope you guys enjoy it after we get done with it, because I don't know if it's going to look right or not. It's supposed to look like a fireplace, but when I get done with it, it might look like a Chevy hot rod. <laughs> hey! No! No! All right, we'll be back with you. Stay tuned. All right. Bye. Okay, we have been working very hard, and this is as far as we've gotten with the fireplace. Let's see. Give you a good look. It's looking very good. Let me step back a little bit. 
It's going to look very nice up there against that wall. So, we've been working hard. Shea Bear and I have been putting the bolts in and getting it all ready. So there's a little update as to where we are on it so far. So we'll get back with you in, in three, two, one. Okay, here it is with the mantelpiece on. And the next time we cut in to show you, it's going to be up against the wall with the, heat, the heater in and done. So we'll get back to you with that. Okay, YouTube, we got this fireplace put together. It's looking pretty good. What do you guys think? We really like it. We think it really added something to the house. Well, actually, who put it together? I did. Pooh Bear did, with a little help from Shea Bear. Yes, I assisted you, but who put in 95% of the bolts? I did. Pooh Bear. And yeah, that's right. Pooh Bear did it. So Pooh Bear, I think, did a great job. Um, you want to tell them some of the features on this? You want to come up and walk, walk them around it? And we haven't got carpet yet, so they don't care. They know we're working on the house. Yeah. You can see kind of the details on, on the mantle here. Kind of up close here on the details. And it kind of matches our woodwork. That's what we was looking for. Yeah, in the the simulated fireplace here, actually blows heat. We can turn that on or off, up or down. And same with the logs and the fire in the back. We can turn that on high or low or brighter or yeah. whatever. Right. So yeah. we can make it. Um, lighter if it's clear dark and it's too bright we can turn the light down on it but we can turn the heat on and off or up and down so and i think it's 48 i, I said 4000 or 42 it's 4800 btu and i it will heat a 400 square foot uh room but Pooh bear did did most of it herself I helped her, but um, I think she did an excellent job. She tied the bolts, started them all, and I just kind of showed her where things went, and that's we went from there. Yes, we did. And it looks really good. What do you guys think? Now, we could have got a 72-inch, which would have been about right here to right here but it was lower and it looked more like a dresser didn't it Pooh? yes it did because it had some drawers and it had a space here that was wide open that would have been fine for the dvr but um it, it just it looked more like a dresser look like a dresser an old style dresser missing the mirror is what it looked like now we did have to raise the tv up uh what did we get seven and a half inches yeah we had to raise the tv up seven and a half inches because i wanted to make sure we had enough room here so it worked out it worked out pretty good yeah. which wasn't too big of a problem because i already knew where the studs were i just had to go straight up seven and a half inches on all of them and so it, we had fun it just took <laughs> oh you got me on there um uh, it took us a few hours, but we took our time. We read the instructions, and um, which is... Wait a minute. Stop right there. What? A man read an instruction manual when he was putting something together? No, I didn't have to. <laughs> she had to. <laughs> um, and when she said, no, no, that ain't right. <laughs> Who was right? You were right. That's right. And I didn't even look at him. <laughs> but, uh, but no, she did a great job. I'm proud of you, Pooh. Thank you. And uh, we got this. It was, what was it, five ninety nine. Yes, it was. Um, but there was a problem with 
the insert, the fireplace insert. When we turned it on, what happened? It went. And then stop. <laughs> yeah. There's a little rock, the rod inside there with these reflecting silver things that spins. Now, when they put this together from the factory, it wasn't straight across. You got to bend it to put it in. It wasn't connected clear on in on this side, so it couldn't spin. It was up like this. So I had to take the back off of it, which you shouldn't have to do. Anytime you buy something for six hundred freaking dollars, you shouldn't have to fucking fix it. No, you shouldn't. And the one we looked at was identical to this that did the same thing but I thought well you know it's been banged around it was scuffed up well it's a display model so what well we get home I plug it in I was pissed off <laughs> I was like you know what you're not supposed to take them apart but guess what YouTube I fixed it I ain't fucking doing this shit again T taking it all apart taking it back and dicking with that bullshit I fixed it I knew what was wrong with it but if you have that problem I don't know what company it's from but I think they need to do a better job on putting their shit together because it's just a little thin rod with a bunch of fucking flappers on it and it was bent like this because it wasn't all the way in and once I put it in on the other side it took what all together a minute and a half to take the back off and fix it Hoover yeah about that and it wasn't very long at so all as soon as it because I turned it on and then I gr I grabbed it and kind of put a little pressure on the well my right but your left hand side and it just popped right in and that thing was straight but it was, it was like that it couldn't turn that's the kind of shit that you buy anymore for 600 bucks and but you know what are you going to do you know I mean we can't put a fireplace in here because we have a stairway back there uh, there's no way we can do that, you know. I mean, we could do one in there, but that would cost a little bit more, six hundred bucks, <laughs> yeah. just in materials. So we, we got this. We we thought it looked kind of. It's a little darker and, of course, newer than what we've got, you know, on our woodwork. But we tried to match as close. What is this wild cherry? Or it said cherry. Yeah, but it was wild chair or something I, I think so I don't remember something like that it was uh but um, I'm sure at one time the issues looked like that kind of but this this is pine and this is simulated cherry but we couldn't get any pine so we did the best we could I think it turned out okay we still need to go against the wall but to plug everything in somebody went through the baseboards so that brings us out at least an inch and uh, so once I change that and put the the uh, receptacles in the wall that's going to put us back you know a half to three quarters of an inch and then now remember we've got the tack strips back there and once we get the carpet in I can go clear back to the baseboard and it's going to be it's going to be really close it'll look decent I mean it's simulated yeah but it, it, it's what we needed there. It's what we needed there. So I think what we need to do is ask, what should we do along this wall, Peter? Oh, I don't um, know. This, this wall We've right. got a empty wall over here, so we're trying to decide what we're going to do with that wall there. So, any ideas? Comment below and let us know. Because we've got the family wall. Yeah, we got our family wall over here. But we need something over there. We're not sure what we want to do yet. No, we're not. So, what do you guys think? What should we put there? Right, right in there. Yep. I mean, there's a lot of ideas going through our heads, but it's not really going to match anything what we've got in the house. So, you know, what do you guys think? Talking yeah, just suggest something to us and maybe we'll put it up there. So, that's a challenge for you guys. <laughs> yeah, and then give them one last look at the fireplace, honey. And, and here you go. She did 90% of that herself. I'm very proud of her. And it was everything. This was off. 
This piece was off. This piece was off. This piece was off. Every one of these pieces was off. She did this all by herself. So I'm very proud of her. She did 90% of it. I just kind of helped her lift things. And, you know, it, it does come in sections. A lot of sections, huh, babe? Yes, it does. And she did very good. Like I said, it's just not one thing. This was one thing. The side was one thing. This was one thing. That it just it she it she did a great job. I'm very proud of you, Pooh Bear. Well, thank you. And she was so happy. Yes. <laughs> Wasn't you? Yes. So there's our, our little project, our weekend project that, that we've we completed in a few hours and uh, yeah. I think I think they can do it themselves. What do you think? Yeah. How anybody much can around here behind the the uh, and give them a better view there. Okay, and then there's one last look of the fireplace there. Take it still while you're talking. There you go. And there you go. And I'm Pooh Bear, and I'm out. Well, uh, We'd like to thank everybody that joined us on our little, what was it? Live. Live thing. Everybody was awesome, man. There's so many comments on there that they were commenting at the time that we didn't see, but I'll get back to them. But we wanted to throw that in. We thank you guys a lot for your support. You know, there's just too many people to list that that uh that joined in and um that tuned in and watched us um we thank you guys very much don't we Pooh Bear? yes we do all right well give me a shot of that and we are out of here all right well, Pooh Bear out shaver i'm gone thank you mm -hmm.